My name is Chris Kwaja. I'm the country director of the United States Institute of Peace in Nigeria. The Symposium on Peace and Security in Nigeria, with specific reference to governors from the Northwest and some from the North Central part of Nigeria, was an, op is an opportunity for them to come together to learn from the experiences of the United States of America as well as other countries that have confronted issues around the management of diversity, how the state as a major institution and vehicle for governance can mobilize resources, both human and financial, in driving change. Northern Nigeria is a highly cultural environment. It's a society where people believe in leadership as an agency and catalyst for development. It is important for governors to harness uh, the social capital that exists across communities. My name is Senator Obesani, the governor of Kaduna State. My name is Caleb Mutfuang. I am the governor of Plateau State, North Central Nigeria. We've been having a lot of uh, sectarian crisis uh, since 2001. Uh, it started as a farmers had as clash, but it snowballed beyond that. And today what we are experiencing, some bit of banditry, some aspects of terrorism, and um, senseless killings, really. And um, what we are dealing with is uh, a situation where we have a lot of uh, ungoverned spaces that need to be properly manned. We believe good governance is the most effective non kinetic approach to addressing this problem. So we need to also try as much as possible to bring our people closer to us by giving them all the necessary basic amenities of lives and uh, making sure that we support uh, small businesses in the state, uh, support smallholder farmers. That is the only way we can also ensure that uh, we do not allow the bandits to continue to recruit more people. Uh, last month, precisely two months ago, uh, about uh, 137 uh, children were kidnapped in uh, one of the schools in Cardinal State, but within 16 days, we worked closely with the federal security agencies and we brought back all the 137 children back home safely. And the reason why we were able to achieve that is because of synergy between the Cardinal State government and the federal security agencies, as well as ensuring that we also carry the communities at the grassroots level in trying to address the problem of insecurity in our state. That has really helped us. That is the reason why in a record time, we were able to ensure that the 137 children were brought back home. We believe very sincerely that peace is not the presence of security personnel, rather is the absence of security personnel. And so we're trying to address, address the root causes so that the reasons for which those communities became restless can be eliminated, and therefore the need to keep security agencies there would also be eliminated. As a capital of Nigeria, we have people who are from different parts of Nigeria. We have a number of Muslims, Christian, different tribes, and because of that, we experience a lot of uh, conflicts. That has to do with religion, with ethnicity, but because we have a peace commission in Kaduna State, that have worked closely with the USIP in about in the last few years. And I can say because of the intervention, the support of the USIP, now in the last one year, we have not experienced any ethnic or religious crisis in Kaduna State. Mm -hmm.